Sherry Driver. I'm Associate Editor for McCall's Quilting and I'm going to show you how to join binding strips. I have a couple of strips cut here and I'm just going to sew a diagonal line from corner to corner. Some of the um, editors here do it without drawing a line, but I'm going to do it with a line because that's what works best for me. So I've just lined up the ruler from the corner to corner. I have the two strips are set at a right angle and I'm just using a pencil that's going to show up on this fabric. The strips are right sides together, so I'm drawing on the wrong side of the fabric. And this is the diagonal line that I want to sew on. Because I might shift them when I sew, I'm going to pin them. And all pinned and ready to go, and now I'm gonna get my sewing machine and sew on that line. And now I'm just going to sew the line that I marked. You can see why it's important that you are, are able to see it. Don't want to stitch over my pins. And I've just sewn right on my marked line. Clip the threads off. So there's my stitching and I'm ready to cut off the excess fabric. I'm cutting it off, leaving about a quarter of an inch. It's already sewn, so you don't have to be exact about what you've left behind. And now I want to um, press the seam allowances open. I'm just going to finger press it, but you will take it to your, sew or to your ironing board and you're going to press that seam allowance open. And you do that to join all of the strips that you need for your binding.